Hey everyone, it's Simplicity and welcome back to a new video. Today we have the Landum Genetics Challenge. It's been a while since I've done one of these videos, but I decided I wanted to do one today, so that is exactly what we're going to do. So we're just going to go ahead and start with the sim that, you know, popped up when I opened Create a Sim. I do currently have some custom content installed. But okay, so it looks like that's what we are getting for her skin tone. I'm just going to randomize everything three times. Head shape, I feel like it doesn't make that much of a difference. But I'm a little bit excited, a little bit nervous just to see what we, you know, come up with today for Sims. Ooh, okay, so she's got a little bit of a elongated face. Um, ears didn't really change all too much. One, two... Three. Oh, she's got pretty eyes. They're a little bit small, but they're pretty. Two, three. Okay. She's not terrible. Two, three. Honestly, she's not that bad. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do her hair first. I am just going to leave it where it's possible to be anything. Okay, so it looks like we are going with a bit of a cheese-colored afro. Um... Okay, so her eyebrows are not too bad. Honestly, she's not that bad. Um, I believe they added in where you can actually randomize skin details now as well. So we might go ahead and do that. But, alright, so she's got the cute little, like, gap teeth. Um, I don't think I want, like, any of the scars or anything, but I am going to go ahead and randomize skin details. Okay. Alright, so she's got a skin of some sort and a beauty mark, and that's about all that I'm noticing. But I am going to cheat just for a second and add some eyelashes to her, because honestly, that's like my main thing that I need on a sim. She's got a ring on, so that's kind of interfering a little bit. But I am going to go ahead and just make sure that she's got some eyelashes. I don't know. I just, that's kind of my main thing with sims. If I couldn't play with any other sort of custom content, I'd be okay with that. But I need CC eyelashes. I feel like it just gives Sims a whole different look. Okay, so I'm just going to test out hats and see what we get. Okay. I'm not mad at that. I feel like we can work with that. Um, and then we'll go ahead and do the accessories here as well. Alright, honestly, I'm not mad about that. I feel like that's okay. Um, and then we can also randomize makeup, which I don't know how much of that we are going to be able to see under her glasses. But that's interesting. She looks like she didn't blend her concealer out. Um, alright, we're just gonna kind of, you know, work with it. And then we'll just randomize this a couple of times. She got the daisy one. So, honestly, it's a cute eyeliner, but it's probably not gonna go that well with this. Okay, and now we are part mermaid. Makeup might have been a bad idea to, okay, so it only randomized twice, but we're going to go with it anyways. And, um, okay, so she might be a mermaid. I'm not all too sure, but at least, like, makeup and such doesn't change, like, all the genetics. But, okay, so there's her body type. Oh, we can also go ahead and randomize tattoos, which I'll go ahead and do. Looks like we only have... The one, which kind of looks like a kid lit, so it's kind of cute. But, oh, and then she's got stretch marks, which is also very cute. I like that. Okay. We're going to hop in. We're going to do some outfits. Um, two, three. We can work with a basic black sweater. Two, three. Okay. Honestly, not that bad. One, two, three. Okay. Honestly, I'm not hating this outfit. One, two, three. Okay. Outfit, not that bad. I feel like she's honestly not that bad. Makeup's a little bit interesting, but other than that, non-committal. She's got some interesting traits, I'll say that. Self-absorbed, non-committal, and erratic, was it? And then I'm just kind of randomizing everything here. All right. 
Um, uh, I'm just gonna leave her likes and dislikes. So here they are. I'm not gonna like leave them all out because there is a decent amount of them. But I will have these sims up on the gallery if anyone's interested. My gallery ID should be down below. And uh, let's just go ahead and name her. So this is Kelly. Alright. Or Katie, sorry. This is Katie. She's got a cute name. But let's go ahead and make Katie a partner. Alright, so said partner, what is your name? Two, three. Alright, so this is Brady, and uh, we'll just randomize his traits here too. So he is childish, gloomy, and active. Interesting. Just randomize his likes and dislikes here quickly. Um, here, He's got a lot more likes than dislikes, but here they all are, just so I don't have to entirely like, read them out. But, uh, and then we'll do aspiration while I close my eyes, and... All right, so he wants to be a master mixologist. Not that bad. Okay, let's see. What are we going to get out of you? I'm just going to remove the hair just so we can kind of see the face a little bit better. One, two, three. Okay. I don't think I've ever used this skin tone. One, two, three. I feel like nothing really changed there other than eyebrows. One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three. Okay. One, two, three. He's got a good face shape. One, two, three. Ears fit his face quite nicely. Okay. One, two, three. Eyes are very dark, but I feel like it kind of contrasts nicely. Cute little button nose. One, two, three. Okay, the lips are a little creepy, but I feel like that's all right. One, two, three. Okay, so red hair. I kind of like that hairstyle, actually. Um, one, two, three. All right. I had a little bit of lag there, but all right. Um, and then we'll do some facial hair, too. Apparently, we're not getting a whole lot of facial hair. Totally fine. And then we'll hop over here, do some teeth quickly, too. One, two, three. Oh, they both have the gap in their teeth. Cute. And then skin details, too. All right. So... We ended up with just a few little kind of beauty marks, but I feel like that's not that bad. And then we have some purple earrings. I'm going to see what a hat is. Honestly, that's kind of cute. I don't hate the little blue hat. I was going to say if it hides too much of the features, I might like take them off, but I kind of like it. I don't know. I feel like we can work with that. And then we'll go ahead and randomize the body type quickly here as well. One, two, three. Not much of a change that we could see. But all right, tattoos. He's got a few tribal and I think the bird on his back. So not bad. I like being able to like randomize everything. But okay, so let's go ahead. We'll randomize the outfit. Okay. Matches kind of with the hat. Not bad. One, two, three. Are those pajama bottoms? Maybe he's attending like a Zoom meeting. Well, he only has to be like casual on the like business formal on the top. But let's go ahead. We're going to make a baby. Um, I have to kind of try to see what angle works here that I'm not like spoiling the child or like what they end up looking like to us. But I think I'm going to do a daughter. I feel like that's an okay angle. But yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and do a daughter. Um, and then we'll just go with the teenager so we can kind of see the features more. I'm just going to randomize it three times here as well. And then we'll see what we get. This sometimes takes a little bit longer, but that's okay. Alright, so we have a cheese-haired sim. Oh. Okay, she's not bad. She's got a bit of a pointy outy chin, but like she's not bad. So I think we can work with that. Um, her traits aren't going to be all too bad either, I don't think. I don't think they can really be. So we have active and glutton. 
And then I'll just do the likes and dislikes here quickly as well. So here they are, you know, just as a quick little overview. And then we'll also go ahead and do the aspiration while I close my eyes. Um, okay, so we have love. So we have two that we can choose from here. Soulmate. All right, so name. One, two, three. So this is Nevea. I'm going to hop into a voiceover. Okay, so we're hopping into a voiceover just so I can go ahead and chat with you all while I do a makeover because this took me a little bit. And I didn't want this to be like an overly long video. So at this point, we're just trying to see what is going to make Nevea look her best. Um, she didn't end up with the gap teeth. I did look. I was kind of curious to see. But yeah, we're just going to hang out for a little bit here while we do a makeover. I tried my best to kind of like make everything kind of highlight her fairly nicely. But I didn't know what I wanted. Her traits were a little bit boring, I guess I would say. So I didn't know exactly what I was wanting to do with it. But I wanted this cute little outfit. I think I wanted the black one. I don't know. I felt like this just kind of suited her. And then we added some tights. And I kept the sneakers because I thought they were cute. Did I not? Oh, I guess I gave her the boots. I thought I kept the sneakers. But uh, she ended up having some interesting, you know, lipstick options and, like, makeup options. You will see that I do sometimes like to randomize makeup until there's something that I actually like. Um, instead of me, like, sitting here, you know, trying to figure it all out. But I thought she'd be someone that was, like, a member of the cheerleading team. So I went with that. I don't know. She gives off cheerleading team vibes to me. Um, and then her outfits, honestly, they weren't that bad, but you're seeing that I am, I am just kind of randomizing things. I like being able to see what they do and like, I don't know, sometimes it works out for me. And then this was her hot weather and then her cold weather. I think I gave her an outfit like this and I think that was kind of about it other than makeup. So I'm going to go ahead and actually wrap this video up right here. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, you can hit the like button down below. If you want to see some more videos from me, you can go ahead and subscribe. I post videos typically three to four times a week right now. If you are already subscribed and want notifications when I post, hit that bell down below. Make sure that your YouTube notifications are turned on. And I will see you all next time. Bye lovelies.